So I just checked that same spot where those fence posts are and uh, found another two line. It's a couple days later. It's been raining for the past couple days and today it's going to be the low 70s. So yeah, really cool. I'm going to go ahead and put this guy back. Awesome. All right, just got this. Oh, just spotted this pickerel frog going through the grass. I could hear tons of spring peepers too, so pretty weird day. All right, see you later, buddy. Take off. Here's some mushrooms I've been looking at for like a couple weeks. Really pretty. Nice neon orange. I don't know what they are, but they're cool looking. So I am out here looking for salamanders and any other bycatch we come across. It's like the low 70s, so I'll let you know when I find anything. So yeah, definitely one of this year's offspring. It's really small, but awesome. Gonna take some photos and then let this guy go about his business. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and put this baby garter snake back. Really pretty dorsal stripe. Got some breaks towards the top, but really cool. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put this baby garter right back where I found him. See you later, little one. Awesome. Just got this humongous male pickerel frog. And take a look at that aposomatic coloration. Nice yellow on the back of the legs, on the bottom of the legs. Really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and take some photos and then put this guy back. All right, gonna go ahead and let this big male pickerel frog get back on their way. See you later, dude. It's a few days later, we just flipped that log and found this two line under it. Now, I'm a little far away from a seep, but Pretty cool to see one up here. Awesome. Really pretty Eurycia. Nice bright yellow tail. You can't really tell in the video, but it's got a nice tail. Nice two lines. Cool speckling too. But I'm gonna go ahead and put this guy back. Took a couple photos. And yeah. Awesome. Alright, just flipped this log. We found a little black widow. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Really pretty. I love those three red dots on the back. But if I could flip this guy over, he's all balled up right now in his defense posture. But. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, here's the Black Widow upside down. You can see that hourglass right there. Flip this guy over real quick. Okay. Really cool Black Widow find. Alright, I'm going to gently put this log back down. Nice to not squish the spider. Oh, cool. Just flipped this little juvenile red back. Looks like they lost part of their tail. But awesome. Nice. Nice red dorsal stripe. Gonna help gonna go ahead and get this guy out and then put the log back. Alright, here's one more look at the salamander. I'll put him back under that log. Awesome. First salamander of the day. 
All right, so a few minutes after that um, redback salamander, I heard something running through the grass and found this newborn garter snake. Now, it is a little, oop. Here's one more look at this juvenile garter snake. This guy's probably only like a month or two old. So, I'm gonna go ahead and let this guy get back on his way. But awesome. Nice garter snake for today. So it's a little while later, it's like 50 degrees today, and I flipped that log and found this really pretty redback salamander. Let me try to get him in the light for you. Yeah, really pretty individual. Take a couple photos and then put him back. But awesome. I can tell this is a male, because right on the front of the face, you can see those Siri. But yeah. Those allow the salamander to locate potential mates. So I'm going to put this guy back and see what else we find today. The awesome first salamander of the day. Really pretty red back. He'll find his way. And a little further up the trail, I flipped that log. Found this really nice looking. And found this lead phase red back salamander. I'm gonna take some photos and put this put the salamander back. All right, I just took a few photos of this lead phase red back. I'm gonna go ahead and put them back. Awesome. Let's see what else we find today. And a little further up the trail, flip that log. Found this nice bright red red back salamander. I'm gonna go ahead and put them back. All right, just flipped this old tire and found another redback salamander. Gonna go ahead and put this guy back now. That nice bright red. There it goes. Cool. All right, just flipped that log and found another redback. Gonna go. Good, uh, gonna go ahead and put this guy back. Awesome. So I just flipped this log where I usually find those four toed salamanders. And right here is a little juvenile. Nice orange on the tail, nice speckling on the side. And take a look at the underside here. Yeah, nice speckling on the underside. But awesome. First four-toed salamander of the year, I'm pretty sure. I have to double check, but awesome. So like I've said before, this is the only species in the genus Hemidactylium. So they're really cool salamanders to find, in my opinion. But yeah, nice little juvenile four-toed. So yeah, here's another look at this four-toed salamander. I probably also said before that these are the smallest salamanders in New Jersey, but yeah, nice seeing them. And I also like this dorsal pattern, really cool, and also the speckling on the tail, just makes these pretty cool salamanders. And they also have really pronounced um, pheromone receptors on their nose, so they look pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna let this little four-toed salamander get right back where I found him. Really nice. First one of the year, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, awesome. So I flipped that tar where I found ring necks and garter snakes and worm snakes under and just spotted this red back. Cool for diversity. Let me get this guy out. So today is November 25th. And nice second salamander for the day. Earlier I found a two line. But I didn't feel like filming it. 
So I'm just going to let this guy get right back to what he was doing. Awesome. So it's currently 43 degrees, and I just found this Nerodia. And they already musked on themselves. Look at that, winter water snake. Today is the 29th of November. Like I said, it's 43 degrees. So how cool. Glad I came over here. I had a feeling I should come down this trail. Yeah, really glad it came out. Cool winter water snake. Awesome. Cool surprise. Look at that underside. Yeah, really glad it came out. Was not expecting to find a water snake. But very happy with that. This guy's moving a little slow to conserve his energy because of how cold it is. It's 43 degrees, like I've said, I think already twice. But, yeah. Really cool. Glad to find this guy. Yeah, look at that underside. Really cool. Probably the last one I'll see for the year, too, because from beyond this point, it's going to get a lot colder. But yeah, nice northern water snake. Going to take some photos and then put this guy back. But nice surprise. Here's another look at this snake. Really pretty. Did not expect to see that today. All right, gonna go ahead and let the snake be. They're awesome. Nice northern water snake. There he goes into the water. Nice. Look at all these green frogs. There's two sticking their heads out right there. And there's another two. There's another one. There's just tons of green frogs in this little, like, ditch. So just to show how cold tolerant these turtles can be, here's a red-eared slider. It's another day that's 43 degrees. It's gonna get to 45, but just goes to show how cold tolerant these turtles can be. Got some good sunlight, and uh, this guy over here was just basking on top of that log so nice to see a turtle out pretty plastron but yeah pretty cool I'm gonna take some photos and then let this guy get back to what they were doing here's another look at this turtle before I put him back yeah this guy's got a massive tail so nice to see a turtle today even though it's an invasive red-eared slider but awesome all right yeah I had to go in this deep up to my knees just to try to get this turtle but right back where I found him awesome my phone's about to die but I'm gonna attempt to get this little baby red-eared slider Got him. nice Look how cute this guy is. Little juvenile red eared slider. Basking on a 43 degree day on this little branch. Awesome. It's a lot easier to catch these guys when it's cold like this, but cool.